And now quickly we're going to touch on some of the more specific options and customization that you can get into when working with snaps. To do that I'm going to go up to my tools menu, options, modeling aids. Now here my grid snap on, ortho snap, every 90 degrees is the current setting. That can actually be changed, planar mode can be on. Now these options here will actually turn on my snap options in the same way that they will if I highlight them down here. I'll just cancel that to show you again quickly. When they appear in bold face that means they're turned on. The object snap, of course, I can raise and lower the toolbar, but that only appears in bold when you select one of the snap options here. So let's go back quickly to tools, options, modeling aids, object snaps, project object to C-plane, snap to locked object, use apparent intersections, snap radius. This is the radius at which your cursor will suddenly jump to the point that you're snapping to. If you increase that, your cursor will jump in there from farther away. Dynamic object snap display, black on white, that's the little flags that are going to come up. Control polygon display. Nudge keys and directions. I always use that on the default setting. This will allow you to use alt and arrow keys to slightly move your cursor. Nudge steps. See, as you can see here, it's set in millimeters. 0.2. 0.05 control nudge and 2 for shift plus nudge. Basically what that means is you're working with a file that's extremely specific. The scale is very specific and you need your snaps, your lines, your points to line up and match perfectly like if you were designing an airplane or something for example. So again just to quickly review the some of those things if I change to near select a line, as you can see, now I'm right about at my cursor, but now I'm a little further away. This is that radius, the 15 pixel radius where it turns into a near snap cursor. And as you can see my little flag there is white background with black text. And so all of these snap features and options can be customized going to Tools, Options, Modeling Aids.